Hello everyone, this is V Buzzing with V. Welcome to another video. Today's video is Happy Mail. This is Valentine's Happy Mail from Ashley Bright Crafts. I will have her linked below. We were in a group swap with Rachel Tolman as the host. The swap is called Secret Cupid Swap. It happens every year and I am I love it. I just love being in the group. So head on over to all of the other talented creators that will be listed in the description below. Ashley sent so much. This is a large priority box and I am floored. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open it and I cannot believe she sent this much. Oh my goodness. I am very excited to get into this. I know Valentine's has passed. However, you guys... Valentine's is always something that you want to open. <laughs> so I'm going to put the box aside and let's get into it. I will have that sped up. Oh, wow, you guys, look at all of this. I am floored. It's so much. This is too much, Ashley. She, oh my goodness, I owe you. Let's go ahead and dig in. Oh my goodness, it's so much. Okay, let's get into this. Oh, let's this one right here, it, it opened itself up. So, oh my goodness, first of all, look how cute this box is. How cute and adorable this is. I just love her crafting style. It's so neat and clean. Neat and clean is all I see. And I just love what she did here. Um, from the looks of it, it looks like you like blue and pink a lot. And there's hints of red here. But let's get into this little box. It's such a cute little box. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at this little thing. Oh my goodness, how cute is that? I love this charm here. Hearts as cherries. How cute is that? It looks like she's stitched a lot of stitching here. And just made a miniature tag and I just love what she's done stickers as well and uh, there's a heart sticker there she did lots of stitching this is so cute this is the cutest thing <laughs> oh my goodness I love this right here the paper clip I just love what she did she stitched oh my goodness how cute is this I love this this is so cute Ashley Wow, look at those. I love that. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. Is this doodle bug? It's cute. I love it. Memories and hugs. She has more stickers there. XOXO. Love. I hope I'm not too far. I have the camera very up high. Um, higher than I usually. And you guys, oh my goodness, this flips over. Oh goodness. It's stapled with like, is it stapled? It's like a matchbook little. This is the cutest thing I ever seen. I love that telephone. Oh my goodness, I love this. And it came in this little box. I'm not sure how this is, I maybe a bow, but I just love how she did this. This is so cute, <laughs> the cutest thing. Oh my goodness, I can't imagine what else is in here because that one was just the cutest thing ever. Now, I have this envelope here. I love how she did some hearts and some uh, rhinestones. She added a typewriter, the heart. It's so cute. Envelope. I think this is my card. This may be my card. Yeah, let me go ahead and read that. Okay, thank you so much, Ashley, for everything. I just love it all. And yes, it's very, very exciting to be swapping with you. We've never swapped before. That was her card, and I just love how she decorated it. Okay, next thing is, oh my goodness, look how cute this is. The cutest thing i ever seen. Oh, I know where you got this from. This bow is from Amy L. Because I sent her one too, how funny. Um, Amy does the most cutest bows, right? I love what you did here. This is such a cute little banner. It has the puffies on the side and a cluster. And I love how she did the wood veneer on top of ephemera pieces. And such a cute little piece. 
This could definitely go on <clears throat> anything. And I just love the miniature case that it came in. She did, oh, there's something in there. I thought this was glued, but it's a little shaker. I love that little tiny shaker. And it is heat mended there with the um, we, are, we Are Memory Keepers tool, the Fuse tool. How cute is this? This is so cute. Thank you, Ashley. Next one is another one. This looks like the same thing. Let's get into it. She has Amy L's bow and a little container, a little charm. And yeah, it is the same thing. And I just love how she used those wood veneers. I so need some floral wood veneers. I love that. Such a cute little shaker. I just love this. Was there another one in there? I thought I saw one. No. Such a cute little piece. Look at the back. So cute. Thank you so much. That is sweet. I just love the sweetness of it. Oh, I see him. I see two more. So let's get them out. I see. Let's see here. That one's not it. Oh my goodness. I can't wait to dig into the rest. Another one. Um, she has the same bow. It's tied the same way. This one is the same thing and it has little shakers. So sweet and delicate and clean. I just love the cleanness of your crafting. It's so clean. Um, mine is just all over the place. All kinds of stuff happening. <laughs> um, here's another one. Let's get into it. I just love this blue. It's such a nice blue. And she has a same similar one to the last few but the shaker and the dangle the dangles on this other side on the right side purples pinks and blues and then the shaker is hot pink I love these these will definitely be used Next is this one here. I love how she tied a tassel. I love the color of the tassel as well. Very dainty. It says just because and it is looks like a little doily. Yes, it's a doily embellishment and she embellished it with some chipboard and I believe this is Maggie Holmes and I love the blue floral. I love purple here. Just the hint of purple on, on the inside. You can see some vellum and it is, it has some gold on there, some foil on it. Such a cute and delicate piece. I love your, your crafting. You went all out though. So much to look at. And oh my goodness, that one fell out. But we, we could secure that shortly here. Okay, next one. Let's grab the small ones, you guys. <laughs> Let's, oh, I love how she did this. We have similar taste. I love making my own clips and I love clips. So thank you for this. I will definitely be using that in an album. I'm gonna set it down right here under my um, monitor, computer monitor. And that way I remember to use it. But I love how she did this bag. It looks like this is washi tape and she just added it to this bag and I loved how she clipped it and it's just a cute glassine bag that she decorated and this beautiful sequence that she sent I love all the colors it has butterflies in it it has all different sizes of sequins lots of pinks and blue match this collection thank you so much for that because I enjoy sequins Okay, next one is this. I love how she put this rosette on top of an ephemera piece and then added her clusters to the top. And I just love how she clustered it. It's so pretty and delicate. Again, I'm gonna be saying that a lot because her crafting is very delicate and clean. And I just love her bag topper as well. It's a doily bag topper with some stitching across the 
the top here you can see that so delicate you guys and in here she had double acetate here and she added some embellishments and these are some envelope embellishments and they're stuffed with ephemera pieces as well as chipboard pieces she also has the sequence here in a line I love how she did that that is so cute and I just love the stickers and the staples there this is such a cute little project I just love it thank you so much for that thank you for the time and effort you put into this too because I can tell you um you really thought about what you were doing love it love it love it love it okay next one is this one here Ooh, I love this one um I see some um what is it sweet stories I see sweet stories in there I just hope my camera's picking up it's late at night everyone's sleeping usually the colors aren't as bright as I want them to be look at this ladybug I love how she added sequence to it she has a rosette on some doilies and she has some ribbon right here and I love her little cluster here and she has a clip here and it's um paired with some of these miniature tassels and I just love it let's get into it these are some doily embellishment I love her floral here on top of a floral I just love how that looks um, it says my favorite place feel like home and I just love her cluster here she has vellum in the back and she also has ephemera pieces chipboard pieces and I just love the pinks with the yellows and the greens so pretty definitely so pretty and clean and delicate I love that that will definitely all of this is going to be used um, oh, I forgot to put this on there. So the clip, I don't want to forget that. So when I do my reel, it's all set in there. Okay, this one right here. Oh, look at this. Another clip I get to use. Putting that right under my monitor again. Right there. I love clips, you guys. Okay. I love how she did this. This is such a cute little box. Such a cute little box and I love how she put rosettes in here and they're very large rosettes and look at that how cute is this this is so cute it has some stitching in them oh I just love that snail how cute is that I love the colors as well Ooh, this one's pretty this one has some pink vellum in the back the others do too I didn't notice and I love the blue and the pink against the sweet story paper and I just love how she mixed and matched um, I've been doing that lately too and I just enjoy it so I love this thank you so much I just love how sweet it looks I love the brown too of the wood along with the um, pinks it just looks so pretty okay she did another one here similar and I'm keeping it of this clip I just love clips you guys that one's gonna be used I love making clips um, can't ex express that enough she has some large plain rosettes that I can decorate myself and I will be using this next year make it work I will definitely make it work I just love the colors too oh look at this blue I love the st your style of crafting it's so cute and then she has memory dex cards in here look at that pink and then this one a blue style and uh, although no, that one's like more teal and then this one's blue with pink I just love it thank you so much I wonder if you have your information back here um, no information but they do have pockets I just love that I didn't notice that so I love how she put this in this wood little case oh so cute how cute is that wow I love this so pretty okay next we're getting down to it um let me go ahead and do this one first since it's already peeking through oh my goodness I'm telling you we crafted almost the same I used the jar too but a plastic one decorated the top 
and I just love her decoration. And in here are rosettes. I thought they were plain, but we have plain ones here. Pinks and blues. Love the color, so pretty. And then we have decorated ones here. I wonder how many minutes I've gone. We have decorated ones as well. And I just love their uh, the cross stitch die that she used. I just love it. And she added some um, stitching, which I love the edges sticking out. I did the same in some of my projects. So cute. I love the dots that she added. And such a cute little cluster that she did. Ooh, there's one right at the bottom that I completely forgot. Take out. And look at that one. How pretty is that? It's so cute. I hope you guys can see this. I'm so far away. My hands look so tiny now. <laughs> But I love it. Thank you for these. These will definitely be used. And you guys, um, head on over to the other lady, especially the host, Rachel. Thank you. Okay, this bag here. I just love this loaded bag. I love how she decorated it as well. She has a tassel right here to my right. And it's, it's on a clip. And look how beautiful this is. Oh my goodness, I love the buttons on this, um, what is it called? Uh, twine, I love it. It's so pretty, I never thought of that. I'm definitely scrap lifting this. That is so pretty. I love how she just included buttons. She has a handmade tassel here, and then she has this one right here, which I love making these two, these are pretty. And then a star here, and she did some wire wrap. So pretty, Ashley. And then in here, look at this. This bag is decked out in sequence with some ephemera pieces and some stitching. And in the front, she has a little piece here. Ooh, there's something here. Oh, she sent me some doodle bug pops. I've seen these before. I just, um, this is the first time that I've had it, oh, 4th of July, how cute is that? But she sent me a bear with some bees, I love bees. And um, how did you know? <laughs> um, could it be my name? No. Um, this bag topper here, and it's on a doily. She has some rhinestones right here and some stitching. She has a bird, and these are bottle caps. I'm not gonna take these ones out. They're so delicate and tiny but she also clustered them like her rosettes and I just love that idea. I've never seen that before. How cute is that? And then I'm gonna put that back here. How did you have this? Okay, get in there. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> I don't wanna go in now. I took it out, now I don't wanna go in. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Ooh, another clip. Woohoo, thank you for my clips, I love them. <laughs> in here, let's take it all out. So, taking it all out, let's look at the back. I didn't notice the back, the back is in purple. And it has some washi tape here in stamps. I just love that, it says right now, OMG. And Happy Mail, so cute. I just love this. Okay, we're gonna squeeze this in. Has to go in, there we go. <laughs> I did it. I did it. Okay, we have some miniature doilies, which I do not have any of these. I thank you for the red. I love it. Oh, some more bottle caps. These are the award bottle caps. And I just love her style, how she decorates them. They're so cute. It's like the Rosette Award embellishment. So pretty. I just love her way of making some bag toppers. I love her cluster, I love the rhinestones and the sewing, I love the colors too. So pretty, Ashley, thank you for those. Ooh, and she sent tons of bags in yellow. I love this yellow. How pretty are these? It says, oh poo, oh my God, stop it. It's Winnie the Pooh and it says, honey bear, how cute. Cute as can be, oh my God, this, this is so cute. Thank you for these. Those will definitely be used. I love that. I love how she included bees. Just a hint of a bee theme in here. I just love that. It's so thoughtful. Oh, I'm not sure if she knows, but if you know, thank you so much for being so thoughtful. I appreciate that. 
And then I just love her bag. We are down to just a bit here. And the last two, let's go ahead and dig in. I think I'm gonna go for this right here. So it's one of those stackable envelopes, which I love. I have yet to make one of these and I love her take on it. It's so cute. So here's the front and then the back right here. I love it, you guys. It's just so sweet. I love the a little rabbit here with the floral. She has a clip here. And the first pocket envelope. No way. Stop. I have been saying throughout this whole video that I love these to make clips with. And she sent me them. They're two heart clusters and she has painted them. Thank you so much for that. That's definitely up my alley i love that then this folds up to reveal the other i like her a little cluster here and then she has some more down here i need to make one of these she also had some stitching on the top of the flap and in here are some more embellishments she just went all out look how cute this is she has these flag banners and they're on paper clips and I just love these. I love them. They're so cute. I always forget to make things like this. I need to do like a sketchbook of everything that we craft for. We craft, we, everything we craft. That way when I join swaps, I don't forget. I always make sure there's nothing else in here. I always come to like a blank. So... I don't ever know what to make, but I just love how she did these. Thank you, Ashley. So much sewing as well. I appreciate the sewing because I know how much, how long it takes to do that. So the next one here, um, she has a cluster to the right here. The paper is amazing. I just love everything that she's done already. She has some shakers here. Look at the bag topper. Let's get into this. These look like tombstone um, shaped but uh, they're not after pulling them out I see the little flap so they're frappies I was gonna say that's so neat that you use tombstone instead of um, the used tombstone for this I thought that was a great idea but then I see this right here and it's a frappy but I love it these are frappy shakers I love this die it's so cute so cute you gotta tell me where this came from I love the shaker <laughs> so cute and then she has this bag topper love it so much um, this is actually the second take in the video um, my storage got full so I had to upload it she has some more coffee cups here and I just love these shakers look at her cluster and that paper is divine I just love this paper look at that I love it okay this is kind of stuck but look at that aren't those beautiful I love them these are so cute I love these thank you so much these are beautiful and if I forgot to go over her bag topper let's do that so I love her bag topper. She has just a little cluster and I love cats. I am so team cat. It's not even funny. I just love cats. That's my, they're my animal. I love them. I go crazy. Um, yeah, I love this ribbon here. I don't even know what type of fabric it is. It feels like mesh. It's so neat. I love it and it's shiny. I love her. Uh, gold thread right here on the side so pretty next is the last one here's the clouds here's a cluster with a doily it says hello down here all of those pieces are ephemera pieces for each envelope and stop it she sent me a pack of ephemera look at all these flowers oh my goodness and I think I think you sent this for this right here right 
because I just love that. That's why I'm, I'm, I'm waiting for the last minute for that. But look at all this. So much ephemera pieces. And these are the bits and pieces by Doodlebug. My first time seeing Doodlebug in person. And my first time having anything owned Doodlebug. So all of everything, all the embellishments you made is definitely going to go amazing with this. And let's go ahead and dig into this one. This is amazing. I love mini albums. And ever since I became Scrap Diva Designs designer, um, I have, she sends a lots of mini album dies and I just love it. Oh my goodness, I can't get in here. Um, look at this, you guys. She has a shaker here. This is durable, very well made. It's hard as a rock. And you can tell that she made it with chipboard and paper as well. And I just love how she did the sticker stamps here on the spine, the back. And I love the paper. I love the color. It's so pretty, you guys. I hope, I hope it's picking it up. But I couldn't help myself as soon as my um, storage became full and I had to upload the part for part one of the video I had to take a peek at this so <laughs> I definitely took a peek I couldn't help it so right here to the left is a pocket and there's something inside here which I cannot get and there's some tags in here I just love that and then right here are um, some shake it's a shaker um, what is this again uh, photo plastic I just love it and then she has this clip here. You clip it on. And then she has this piece here. It's so cute. It flips up, you guys. I could add pictures and journaling right here. I could add pictures and journaling as well. Look at that. A little folder, file folder. You're giving me some ideas because I do have to do a mini album file folder. So it's definitely coming. And she sent some more ephemera pieces to decorate here. And I'm just going to have fun with this. This is going to be so cute. I can't wait, you guys. This is going to be amazing. And then um, another one of those pieces. I just love this. Um, my very first one I got was from Rachel in our swap. She sent me those and I still have them. And then you can add some journaling here. Um, does this flip up? No, it doesn't. But the, here's like a file folder uh, piece here where you can add journaling and a photo and then turn the page here she has a little cluster of strawberries it says my sweetheart this opens up to add more this little book I've been wanting to make one of these too it's so funny that you sent stuff that um that I enjoy and have been wanting to craft and I craft as well and I, it's just yeah it's very we're very in sync here I've been wanting to make one of these uh, because of um Paige Evans little books that she has their um that mini albums they're mini album books and I've been like oh I want to make one of those and look she sent me one I don't even have to make it because I already have one <laughs> so another one of these and I just love them little cluster I could add a photo or you could have some and this is a pocket I think is it a pocket it looks like a pocket yeah it is a pocket I can add so much in here Here's this, um, not, yeah, this is a pocket. Does this pull up? No, it doesn't. It has a sticker there. This one opens. There's another shaker. I love all of these interactive pieces in here. Here's another folder. It's so cute, you guys. And it's so cute. It's like a five by five or four by four or something like that. That's how small it is. Here's another one. These are amazing. I'm definitely going to try and make these those are so cute. And then it has another file folder here. It says always and forever. Such a cute mini album to put my babies in here. My two boys. And then um, right here, a is this open? Yeah. Is there anything in there? I'm not sure. I don't think so. No. Okay. So I could add stuff in there. I could add stuff to this pocket and then it closes. You guys, how cute is that? This was adorable. 
Thank you, Ashley, for this. Everything you made was amazing. I enjoyed everything. And I enjoyed your style of crafting. It's so cute. And um, I hope you enjoyed mine. <laughs> uh, you guys, check everyone out. I don't even want to tie this because last time I couldn't get into this. <laughs> um, check everything, everyone out, you guys. I know Valentine's has passed, but... It's still also pretty and I'm gonna give you some ideas and to craft for spring as well because it's so bright and colorful. Well you guys, I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed that like I did. Bye. <laughs>